Kingdom Hearts soundtracks and the Danganronpa soundtracks. I've been really enjoying the music in these games. Game mode beginner, okay. All right, so we're gonna play on beginner to blast through this. It'd be a lot better, IRL st uh, stuff stressing me big time. Honestly, I'm right there with you, man. I, I might, if I remember, I'm gonna DM you about the shit I'm going through. It's like, it's ridiculous, man. You know, I didn't talk about my favorite characters. That's eh, fine. I still need to learn more about them, though. I like Riku a lot. All right, cool. R E chain of. I'm getting booted out of that. Are you serious, man? Oh fuck! I know exactly what that feels. Like. I'm sorry. Hit, dude. Fuck! If I could help you, I would, bruh. That sucks. Damn, I'm holy fuck. That really sucks. Cause like when that was happening to me like a year or two ago, I was, dude. I couldn't, like, my, my mental was just gone. I couldn't take it. I was so fucking scared. Soulstone? me or does this game look a little bit blurry?
Uh, I agree with you, Ninjasia, on that front with, with watching the KSU trailers, but it would have been... Some of that stuff would have hit me anyway because um, all the Persona fans that I follow are huge Kingdom Hearts fans, like, on Twitter. So they're constantly posting. Like, I've seen the Aquanort picture, like, a thousand times on Twitter. You getting any games from the Steam Summer Sale? A few. A couple. Maybe like two or three. Okay to barge in? But we can't do it if we can't afford the king. The king? How did we even end up here? here? Something just told me he'd be here, okay? Really? Because now that you mention it, I was kind of thinking the same thing. Seriously? Me too. One look at this castle, and I just knew. Yo, does he have a different voice actor? best friends. They're here. He doesn't sound like Sora. I guess great minds think alike. Or is he just Wait, older hey, now? Hold on. It can't be just a coincidence. I literally forgot that I exists. Oh, Kimmy. You don't mean that. Yep, I had it too. Mm hmm. I had the exact same feeling. Gorge! Maybe it's contagious. No, no. Something's screwy. We gotta go take a look. All right. He matured? It's just weird because he still looks like a kid. That way, to the door. <laughs> Are you scared? If he had like a thinner face, I could believe it. And he was taller. He sounds like a teenager, but he looks like he's five. It's weird. Shouldn't we shut the door behind us before we go? Sora! Oh my god, it's a harbinger of darkness. That's it. Who are you? Yes. Oh yeah, I'll try some magic. Fender. Nice. Come on, Fender. Fender. Poor guy. <laughs> Goofy's his scratch and his hit. What's wrong with this idiot? <laughs> Is this the lore reason for why we have to use cards? I should think it's obvious. You don't have the, the cards of the keyboard. foot in this castle, you forgot every spell and every ability you ever knew. Don. <laughs> in this place, to find is to lose, and to lose is to find. That is the way in Castle Oblivion. Castle Oblivion? Here you will meet people that you have known in the past, and you will meet people you miss. I miss? Riku! You mean Riku's here? I mean, didn't we see that last time? Is to find him. What'd you do? I merely sampled your memories. And from what a them, fucking boss, dude. I made this. Oh shit, he made cards. Here we go. To reunite with those you hold dear. What's this? A card? It is a promise for the reunion you seek. Hold the card to open the door, and beyond it a new world. Such a poor excuse. That's such a Proceed, poor excuse. Zora, to lose and claim anew, or to claim anew only to lose. So you wish to enter the castle, then you must duel. <laughs> like what the fuck? 
It's Come a blue on. eyes white dragon. Let's go. You'll never defeat me. You know, are you grabbing Valkyria 66? I think I am, yeah. I saw that, and man, that is too good of a deal to pass. It's literally like six bucks. That is too good of a deal. Oh shit, I got five. Where's my, my dual disc, dude? Yo, move! <laughs> Left. Apparently, I have one world card. Reverse town. Okay. No, I hate it wrong. I'm gonna watch Pinoy get bodied by AI. Come on. This can't be right. We're in Traverse Town. That, that's what the card said, you fucking idiot. What you see isn't real. This town is an illusion created by your memories ingrained in that card. My memories? Why don't you understand, Sora? It's me, Jiminy Cricket. Uh huh. Forget about that, Sora. We lost Donald and Goofy. Yo, he's so slow. Donald? Goofy? Guys, where are you? Does he just keep up that animation permanently? <laughs> they actually stuck his head like... Like, what the fuck, dude? Jesus Christ. What did you do with them? They're at the mercy of the cards now. Oh shit. Master the cards and their strength will be yours again. This is actually the plot of Yu-Gi-Oh, dude. What the fuck? This is so different. The laws of this castle require that your friends be transformed into- Donald is a fucking duel monster now, dude? If you value your friends, you won't fail to pick them up. Wait. Huh? Cards you pick up are added to the top of your stack. Use them and your friends will come to your aid. X to use card. Wait, this is actually Yu-Gi-Oh! What the fuck? I summon Donald the Duck! Like, what the fuck? I place him in attack mode. The cards you use vanish. But they will reappear to aid you time and time again. Cards are the hearts of your friends. Everything in this castle is ruled by cards. Whether an enemy or a door confronts you, cards are the only way to proceed. But you mustn't forget your own strength. Jump, dodge roll. First, think for yourself. Move, then use the cards. Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah. Huh. You now know how to use your strength, but it would be of no use if you lose sight of your opponent. Why is he helping me? I wonder if you can catch me. Oh, R2 now, not R1. Okay. That's different. Every move you make causes a card to disappear. If you use up all your cards, you'll be unable to act. So it's not turn-based? I thought it was going to be turn-based. But there is a solution. Keep using cards until you run out, and I will show you. Okay. You have no more cards, and without them, no power. If you want that power back, you must focus. Bid the cards return to you. They will. Huh? Reloading cards. Quickly select reload card. It's not doing anything. Hold X to reload card. The strength of your heart brought back the lost cards. That made no sense. <laughs> that actually just made no sense. Um, 
what was that up thing that it was talking about? So basically the way this game works is you have your cards. You can't cycle your cards, but whenever you use up all your cards, you can't attack. So you have to stand like somewhere else, reload your cards, and then you have your attack prompts again. Is that how it works? You can recall spent cards at any time. You need only wish it. But each time you do it, the cards will take longer to return. The cards are by no means unlimited. Use them wisely. Anticipate the flow of battle and choose the most effective cards. You may use any card in your deck. I actually have to make a deck? This is so weird. Cycle cards left. Oh, you can cycle your cards. Okay. The four card types you use in battle are grouped into two wider categories. The first category includes attack cards, magic cards, and item cards. The second category consists entirely of enemy cards. To use a card or to use cards from a different category. Touch pad button, change category. Okay. Cards will empower you whether you are attacking or defending. But it is up to you to decide when to attack and when to defend. Do not forget that. Why is this guy helping me? Are you two all right? Where have you been? You tell us. When you opened the door, you saw a strange light, and the rest is just blank. So they don't remember being a card? Gee, that doesn't help. Try to remember what happened. I have to keep my journal up to date. Why is he even with us again? I don't remember. Hey, Donald, where'd I get the new clothes? Oh, yeah, they did change clothes. Oh, me too, Goofy. Somebody's been messing with our clothes. Dude, somebody... Oh... Could it be the cards again? That is for you to ponder. Wow, okay. That's such a fucking rhetorical question, but okay, whatever. Master the cards and make your way through the castle, but from here you walk alone. Alone? We can't let Sora go alone. Yeah, Sora can't do anything without her help. Yo, come on, dude. How are you going to put me down like that? Thanks a lot, Donald. Yeah, I know, right? He's like, <laughs> fuck you, Donald. You sure you'll be okay? Of course. You want me to go alone? Fine, I can take care of myself. The hero speaks boldly. Go then. The rest of Castle Oblivion awaits. Walk the avenues of town of latent memory and you shall meet someone dear to you. I've got a bad feeling about this. Relax, Jiminy. I'm ready for any tricks he's got up his sleeve. How hard can it be to figure out these cards? Uh, how hard? Oh, yeah, I already read that. All I have to do is use one in front of that door over there. Key of Beginnings. Oh, this is like a remastered version of the song. You can perform the following actions in the field. Forward, swing keyblade, jump roll. Striking objects in the field with your keyblade yields various results. Try striking the barrel. Wait, so what's the point of the cards if I can still use my keyblade? Marked object can be lifted and thrown. Approach and press triangle. Touching a Heartless in the field starts a battle, but you can strike the Heartless first to gain the upper hand. Okay. Yeah. Wow! <laughs> okay. Hello? Oh, wait, it has to be Mark. Alright, well, rip. Can I just, like... No? Okay. So I guess I just have to, like, be careful with, like, my attacks, like, when I attack. I can't just spam. Card obtain Tranquil Darkness. What are, what are enemy cards, though? Uh, to open doors in the field, press triangle in front of the door. Yeah. 
What are the red ones? Oh, wait, he didn't see that Pinoy. Wait, what? I didn't, I didn't see what. I'm gonna preface this right now. To proceed to the next room, you need a map card. Map cards are used to synthesize new unexplored rooms. First, select the map card you want to use. Few beginnings is a, is a heart wave. A room where only a few heartless appear. A room where you can save your progress. No heartless. A room where untold stories unfold. Number you see in the middle of the screen is the criterion for opening the door. The criterion displayed now means that the door will open with a value of one or greater. One of what? One of that card? You need to pick a card that meets the criterion. Cards have marked values from zero to nine. Zero cards marked zero are special cards which meet most criteria. The card without a marked value is a key card. So if it's zero, it's a key card? What is a key card though? Key cards are only used at special doors. Okay. So then I have a one card. Then what is a one card? Just a room where, okay. I don't understand what that was, but okay. So if I use that, does that mean I can't, I can't use it anymore? Like, is it used up? The swirling crystal in front of Sora is called a save point. Stand near it and press triangle to open the save menu. Yeah. Oh my god, I can't double jump yet. about this game i played this game in eight years it's fine i'll figure it out um i wanted to remove all the bad memories of this game of any key card i avoided it so don't ask me either you pick up fuel cards throughout the game you also know anything hey well then i guess the is gonna be the carry so now i have to pick a card of two or more how do i know if a card is two or more it doesn't say oh card information so this this is a two so i have to use this Am I? I don't know if I'm understanding this correctly. Okay. Wait, they're actually confused? Wait, what? Wait, oh my god. How do I reload my cards? I don't remember how to reload my cards. I don't want to fucking heal, dude. This triangle? What the hell was that? X? Okay. Oh my god, I'm not used to this. Whoa, this is so weird. It's like, I'm tempted to spam, but I can't spam. Okay. Oh wait, no, I want to use that. Fuck. Meeting ground. This is really weird. HP boost, raise Sora's HP, raise Sora's CP. Learn a new slate. I don't know what either of these are. What? What is CP and what is slate? Slate is an ability? What's what's more important? You do combos and such. How do you pull a card out from hold though? This is attack move. So should I get the attack move? Is health even like useful? Like what well, what would you recommend that I go for? Cuz I'm I was just going to take this, but I mean 
I don't know if... I, well, what is CP? I don't know what CP means. Is that, like, how many cards I can hold or something? No, this is 300, so I don't... Just get health? Okay. What, what does uh, CP mean, though? What does that mean? What does card break mean? Is it breaking my cards or something? Oh, some of my attacks do zero? TP is card points. What are card points? Stagnant space. Okay, I need to know what these attacks do. Back? Hey, how you doing? Oh god. Why isn't this just a turn-based game? I feel like this would work so much better if it was turn-based. Ow. Ow. So what is that? What is the leap? That's a heal. Okay. Uh, uh, no, this. And then... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Fuck, I'm... Bruh. Okay. Refill. Why am I pressing triangle? I mean to press X. God. So I don't get it. How do I use my my health cards? What did these card break? Am I pressing X too fast or something? What does that mean? Okay, now I have a heal card, so heal. He didn't do anything. What? What? Attack it! What are you doing? Are you serious, Goofy? He, he literally didn't do anything. L two. Oh fuck. Uh. Nice. That, wow, that went really well. What is that? Okay, whatever. <laughs> That was so weird. Sleeping darkness. Goofy. <laughs> Dude, he literally did nothing. Okay, so I get health for now. Yo, come on. Hey, chill! Yo, this guy is... Okay, fine. Let's go. Go goofy. That's still pretty useless. I'm not gonna lie. All right. Heartless or low key packing. Oh fuck. Uh, go. Okay, I, I understand the combat to an extent. Cards, what is this? Yu-Gi-Oh! That's what I'm saying, dude.
Oh, I did not think that someone's gonna spawn. I still don't know what card break means, though. Okay, I I think I get it now, to an extent. I actually don't think this is, this is as bad as some people were saying. Oh. I didn't realize that was a fucking heal. I need to watch the cards more. It just seems like I have to micromanage better. You understand CP now? No. I still have no clue what CP is. Yo, Goofy is worthless, dude. What? Oh shit. What? Okay then. That's so weird. It... Like when you run out of cards and I just forget that I don't have any cards, it's like kind of strange. Uh, okay, I'll get HP. When should I stop getting HP? With it and CP is the amount of card points your deck can hold. Oh, okay. So that's what it correlates to. Three or higher. I don't have a three. I have a zero, though. The room where Heartless are drowsy and easy. What is this key of beginnings, though? You have a four, use a four. Oh, it's four or higher? Or three or higher? Oh, yeah, there's an up arrow. Okay. <laughs> They're actually sleep. <laughs> sleep. Wait, why can't I? Oh, now I can. Boom! Uh, hey, Pinoy, I love your edits on most videos. You create a new meme with good content. Uh, hey, thank you, dude. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I guess I appreciate it. Did you like DR1 or DR2 better? So when I add oh, really? Oh, my. I'm sorry, Toaster. I didn't see it earlier. Um, I like DR2 better. I like them both a lot, though. Like, a lot. Does Donald just heal? I thought he, I thought he did, like, an uh, nice attack. I'm gonna go sleep for a bit, have fun. Uh, Alright, dude, I'll see you later. Have fun. Maybe just me, but I like DR1 better. Uh, DR1 is really good. I like DR1 a lot. No, don't leave me. <laughs> now you're stuck with me. 7 out of 10 game, I bet. Nah, Gongan 2, I'd give like a 9. It's fantastic. Gongan 1, I'd give like an 8. Don't know what that is. Oh wait, I woke it up. <laughs> wait, no, he's a son now, never mind. Why do I card break so much? What does that mean? I just lost like 10 cards! What? 
Heartbreak is like a mini stun, but what causes it? And like, why did I lose like 10 cards there? I don't understand. Evil Darkness. What? Oh. I'm still used to pressing R1 to uh. Why do I lose so many cards? What? Wait, is it 4.37 in the morning for you? Oh, you don't know? Okay. Hmm. What's the difference between the crown door and the non-crown door? The cards should be the key. Doors emblazoned with a crown are special doors. You need special cards called key cards to open this door. But just having the key card isn't enough to open the door. You need the key card and one or more additional cards meeting certain criteria. The pick map cards that meet the criteria uh, and you can open the door. Okay. So are these the... Oh wait, I don't have that card. So I can't open it. Okay. Um, you can smack the guys to gain advantage. Oh, like yeah. Persona? Okay. Still recent donation? Hey, God bless. Thank you, my man. Where's Exodia? Dude, I wish I could find him. Pinoy, what's your most hyped game from E3? The easy answer is Smash Brothers. Uh, other than that, probably Elder Scrolls 6, man, DMC5, Cyberpunk 2077. I don't know, man. There's a lot of great games coming out. Four and five. What the fuck? Oh, wait, it can be. A room where Heartless with weak cards appear. If friends, a friend card appears for the battle. From your attack cards are more effective. So when do I get to use your beginnings? Crown doors is uh, either leads to the boss or a bonus room. Okay. So, is this game, like, just linear? Like, is it, am I just going through, like, a labyrinth, so to speak? Is I haven't gotten any story. It's just, proceed deeper into the castle. Oh. that watched Yu-Gi-Oh! Mar Marathon then decided to work on this game. He, yeah, he was trying to watch that Yu-Gi-Oh! Marathon, but then he ended up getting ads every two seconds. That's what happened. Yeah. Huh, my attack didn't go out. Wait, did you beat the other game? Yeah, I finished KH1, now I'm on Chain of Memories, which is apparently worse than series. So far, I actually don't even think it's that bad. I think it's different, but I don't think it's bad.
This is a fun stream. I really gotta go. Now, hey, don't worry about it, yeah. Toaster. I'll see you next time, my friend. Thank you. So much for stopping by. Hope you have to do stuff to so see it. Yeah, God bless you, Toaster, man. It's linear, but you can choose what worlds to do first rather than later. Okay. <laughs> you typed the, the fucking answer twice. Uh, epic. Yeah. Art obtained, Kingdom Key. Oh, there you go. It worked that time. Yeah. What kind of advantage do I get for that? <laughs> you just fucking <laughs> just spam the same sentence like that. Okay. I'm gonna spawn. <laughs> this poor, poor fucking heartless. Yeah. Yeah. play CS. Hey, don't worry about it, my man. Oh god. Oh god, please no. Okay. It would be awesome what? Oh, you're doing both at the same time? Shit, I'm sorry, dude. Oh, I don't have any cards. Kingdom Hearts Deluxe with Nintendo Switch? That would be dope. They should do that. I think it would sell. other doors in here right oh, so that's the only door but I don't think I'm gonna have what I need you shall be the key so I can't open this door then right I have to go back is that what this means Yeah, I don't think I can open this door. I feel like- oh yeah, these, these games could definitely run on Switch. Wait, but I can't open that door either, so... What about this one? Needs, oh, this one needs uh, this card, so... Uh, I need a one or higher, so a room where Heartless will be cards is sure. Stop using the alt tab? Alright, I'll get used to the other shit. Hmm, fighting alone isn't as easy as I thought. I mean, it's pretty easy. Hi, Donald. Hey, Goofy. Don't pop out of nowhere like that. Hey, it's not our fault. We don't know what's going on. Oh, it's Pluto, my boy. Pluto? Things keep getting stranger. What's Pluto doing here? There's nothing strange about that. We came to Traverse Town with Pluto, didn't we? Did we? Check by for going to bed to see what's up. Looks like you beat KH1. Yeah, we finished the first one. Now we're on Chain of Memories. I don't think it's as bad as people were saying it was. No, wait. According to my journal, it was before you met Sora that you came to town with Pluto. He's right. We were chasing after Pluto, and that's how we ended up in Castle Oblivion. But aren't we in Traverse Town? Well, it's not really Traverse Town. I think the card created this Traverse Town inside Castle Oblivion. Who cares about all that? It's too confusing. It's, not, it's really not. 
I don't know where we are, but let's just keep moving forward, defeating Heartless. We'll get somewhere. Oh shit, is that fucking Squall, dude? You better be careful, or it's the Heartless that are going to defeat you. Yeah, you're doing Squall. Leon, it's you. What are you doing in Castle Oblivion? Castle Oblivion? What are you talking about? Traverse Town. And how do you know my name? Who are you? Oh shit, so this is- this really is just digging deep in our memories. I've never met the likes of you before. Quit playing, Leon. You all fought the Heartless- or we all fought the Heartless together, you know that. It's really fun, uh, but it can get pretty hard. The GBA version was hard as fuck. Oh yeah? Uh, look, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't even know your names. You don't? Sorry. I can't believe it. How have you, how can you have forgotten about us? I feel for you, but you've got the wrong guy. Happens all the time. Don't take it so personally. Sir. You do know his name. Now, now, hold on. Who do I... Why do I know your name? You think Leon's just kidding around? If he is, it's not funny. Sora's really upset. Who's kidding around, Goofy? You and Donald are the ones who... Hey, oh, uh, see? You know it. You know it, dude. I don't get it. Something's wrong with my memory. What's happening here? I don't know, Leon. Maybe Aerith was onto something after all. Is it Yuffie? Yeah, it's Yuffie. Hope you're gonna go to sleep now. I need enough sleep for the examination. Good night, my dude. All right, good night, my man, and hey, good luck on your exam, dude. Seriously, I hope the best uh, for you. She said she sent some kind of uncanny kind of power and asked us to look into it. Well, this is uncanny as it gets. Maybe you should take Sora to see Aerith. Yuffie, you know my name. Yep, looks like you know mine too. You know him? Nope, total stranger, but I definitely know his name. Strange, yes, but convenient. We can skip the introductions. How is it that you can accept the situation so easily? I don't get you. Well, I'm gonna run ahead and find or er, and fill Aerith in. Leon, you give him the grand tour. See you later. I'm 100% here. Hey, thank you, my dude. Hopefully, I get the uh, grasp of this game relatively quickly. I guess it's no use pondering over it. Come on, follow me. How you doing, Remy Tem Tem? Dude, Remy, you always communicate to me in emotes, man. It's wild. But they're a heartless wandering around town. I'd better teach you how to protect yourself in battle. See the numbers printed on your cards? They range from 0 to 9. Higher numbers mean stronger cards. I kind of got that already. Uh, if you and your enemy both play cards at the same time, the higher card wins. Oh, okay. Go on, try it out. But that's what causes a card break. And those are his cards at the bottom. Goofy looking kind of thing. <laughs> Yorsh! See how it works? Uh, playing a card higher than your opponent's and breaking through the defense is called a card break. Playing a lower card results in your attack being deflected. Even powerful cards can be deflected if the enemy's card is higher. Whoever is on the losing side of a break is left wide open to attacks and don't let that person be you. This feels like it would work so much better as a turn-based game. I don't know why it's not turn-based. You know what I'm saying? Cards with zero as their value are special. No matter what card the enemy plays, you can break it with a zero card. But if you play the zero card too soon, the enemy can break it with any card they play. In other words, it's the most powerful card if it comes last and useless if it comes first. Try to make the most of it. Card values also affect the cost of assembling a deck. Keep that in mind. Now it's time to teach you how to stock cards. You don't have to use battle cards one at a time. You can also assemble three cards and use them all at once. It's called stocking cards. Stocking cards and using them in threes is much stronger than using cards individually. Go on, give it a try. Stock any three cards in your deck. Okay. Some of your three stocked cards becomes the value you play. 
Oh, okay. The value is usually high and hard to break, and the combo attack deals a lot of damage. Don't hold back, show me what you can do. That looks so much lamer than I thought it was going to look. <laughs> combo attacks aren't the only benefit of stalking cards. Well, choose your cards carefully, and you can unleash special abilities called slates. Slates come in all varieties, and each has its own unique card combination. You should try it out once you've collected more cards and learned a slate or two. But keep one thing in mind. Each time you use stock cards, you lose the first card you pick. You can't reload it. Huh. The lost card won't return until the end of the battle. Relying only on slates will, ca will cause your cards to run out. That means trouble. So probably like only one slate per battle? Yeah, I understand. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. This I think this would actually be super fun if it was turn-based. It's just kind of weird not being turn-based. Turn like, it's not bad. It's just kind of weird is all. Uh, yeah, more or less. I'll pick up the rest when I fight some real battles. Here, I found this lying around. You take it. Remember what I told you and make good use of it. Oh, hey, thank you. Key of Guidance. I remember one of the doors had that. You can keep using slates any amount. I thought it uh, removes your card. First card. Keep it okay, see, that's what I figured. Oh, wait, you said to use these. So, wh what are the card meanings? Red is shadows. Green is, I guess, bonuses for me. Blue, I don't know yet. Okay. Green. Martial Waking. Uh, a room where your attack cards are more effective. You have friends. Blah, blah, blah. A room where the Heartless moves slowly. A room where only a few Heartless appear. A room where many Heartless appear. A room where heartless weak cards appear. So I'm assuming, would you ever want to use like the heartless with many cards? Is it like only for grinding or something? Aerith, have you forgotten me too? I don't know whether to say nice to meet you or good to see you again. I don't think I know you, but I still feel like you belong here. Yeah, exactly. Like, we've never met, but it still it still doesn't feel, uh, feel weird knowing your name. But I'm telling you, we have met. We took on the Heartless together. We were a team. It feels like you're right, but I can't remember. Then I guess you won't remember what you told me. In Hollow Bastion, when I sealed the keyhole, you may never meet again. But we'll never forget each other. Oh shit, so he does remember. Uh, he's right, Leon. I remember you saying that too. I guess I can't write it off as a coincidence then. Okay, so since uh, everyone had me pick beginner for this to blast through the game, is would grinding even be necessary or can I just blast through it? Uh, I don't have any memory of it. But somehow I still remember. I think your heart is doing the remembering for us. My heart? We don't know you, Sora, but your heart is full of memories of us together. Those memories must resonate in our hearts, too. Maybe they tell us things we couldn't otherwise know. So you're saying that Sora's memories are affecting ours? His memories do seem to have a certain power. Maybe it's like that guy said then. This town is just an illusion, something my memories created. And there's someone special to you in this town? How did you- oh, I get it. Uh, my memories are resonating with yours, telling you what happened. Yeah, a friend of mine is somewhere in this town. I mean, Castle Oblivion. Castle Oblivion? What's that? There aren't any castles in- That's not quite what I mean. You're still not sure what's going on yourself, right? Right, we just got here after all. I want to take a better look around. Then go have a walk around town. There are heartless, but that's no problem for you. So you know I can fight. I can't say I know, but I feel like believing you. Let's leave it at that. Yeah, Sora's cocky as shit now, dude. 
<laughs> I beat Ansem. Of course I can handle my... Be the truth. Okay, I remember that uh, one of the boards with that too. Um, I still didn't finish it on Proud, but yeah, I played this fairly recently. Oh, really? Blue cards are bonuses. Chest room and shops. Okay. Oh, so like save rooms too, right? So I need a green card. Any green card. Attack cards are more effective if you have friends. How about this? And actually, I should probably use the nine because I feel like three and up is going to be more common than nine and up. Wait. Oh, did my card already go through? I guess so. All right. Well, whatever. Can't get it back. That's eh, fine. How you doing, Sid? Well, what do you know? It's Sora. Wait, what am I saying? I don't know you. Uh, but you do look like a Sora. But what? What with the spiky hair and baggy pants? It's okay, Sid. That's my name. So you've heard of me, huh? Well, I can't say as I'm surprised. Even Sid's a cocky fucking bastard. Anyway, maybe you can help me out. A friend of mine here is or a friend of mine's supposed to be somewhere in this castle or town. Got any ideas? Your friend, huh? Lately all this town sees is heartless. Can't even take two steps without getting attacked. In fact, this plaza is the worst. The world is a jumbo-sized heartless shows up when that bell rings. So if you value your hide, you'll get out of here while the getting's good. Okay, so that's gonna be the boss we have to fight. Gorse! Maybe we should leave. Don't you wanna see the Heartless? No, we don't. Uh, you should really keep zero and one cards. Okay, so zero and ones are the most important. The bell. Okay, so boss fight. Be careful, Sora. <laughs> Oh, it's one of these things. All right, big man. He has a one, so I can use using a three. So now I have to use a four. Wait, it didn't work. What? Now I gotta use a six. Four. Why am I? Oh, it is hitting it. Okay. Let's use a two. Four. Oh, it feels like a weird pseudo turn-based game now that I'm watching that stuff. Ow. Seven, so now I need to use a zero. Three. You can keep hitting him uh, when card breaks. Oh, okay. I'm like taking it really slow because I'm trying to understand this shit. What is this? Okay, I don't know what that did. Ow. This is a heal, right? I'm pretty sure this is a heal. Heal. Yeah, okay. One. This little card breaks, that's a waste. Ah! Uh two. Fuck. Oh wait, there's a card here. What is that card? Okay. What is this? What is that Mickey card? Am I am I doing this right? I'm not sure. The leaf is a heal. Oh, I know the leaf is a heal, but what's the uh, the Mickey thing? 
So what if the cards are the same? Okay, I think that works. Let me see. Oh, it's like a spell. against bosses. Yeah, that shit's insane, bro. Okay. Oh, wait. I'm, I skipped my zero. That shit is practically a mega elixir. Oops. I feel like I can't attack them when my shit's too low, though. Oh, I have a zero. Never mind. She's a Wait. Is the mega elixir the, um... This? Yeah. Oh wait, there's a card here. What is this? Oh, it's a Mickey card. Oh yeah, the card stock. I remember now. I, I forgot about that shit. Oh shit. XD. Oh! Ow? I get it. It's... I get it now. Uh, sorry not talking much. Playing Splatoon. Hey, don't worry about it. Bro, Splatoon is amazing. Okay, Deyasu. You... you... Thank you, my friend. Thank you, my friend. I get it now. This makes sense. This makes complete sense to me now. <laughs> it only took me like an hour to get, but I got it. So can I only save if I get a save card? Obtained guard armor. Big tip, please. Help. Marina, best wife you do. Marina is... She has pleased my weenie more times than I can count. Your shoe is... Oh my god, shut the fuck up! So your friend wasn't here? No, I don't think I'll find him in this town. But he's somewhere in this castle, I just know it. Castle? Like this whole town's inside some humongous castle? That's rich. He's probably right, Sid. We may not understand what's going on, but Sora does. You can see that reality is bigger than just the world. I wish I was that sure. Start grabbing slates now? Okay. You'll be okay, Sora. No matter what shape reality takes, you can handle it. I may not remember you, but I know you in my heart. Leon. Take care, Sora. I'm a little lost, but best of luck anyway. It just ditched me. Come on, dude. Poor Sora. Oh my god, Aerith, you are beautiful. What's up? I don't have all the answers, but I had to tell you something. Your memories created this town, right? That's what the guy uh, who gave me that card said. If that's true, then this town is just a figment of your mind, and so are we. That's depressing. But you can't be a figment. You're standing right there, too. Or right here. This town is here, too. But I'm not really me. I don't remember the things I should, and I sense things I shouldn't. Sora, beware your memories. If the journey In the journey to come, you'll be faced with more illusions. Sometimes the shadows of your memory will deceive you, try to lead you astray. So, uh, what exactly do Bro, sorry, you can't be this dumb. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm just another illusion. The truth is out of my reach. Don't say stuff like that, it's depressing. <laughs> Stay strong, Sora. Don't let the illusions distract you from what's truly important. Okay. Wow. Okay. Sora. Are you ready to go? 
Yeah, be right there. It's like a paradox, it feels like it. Well, I better get going. It's not there, I see. Yeah, I figured. Aerith? The figment of your imagination, you fucking idiot! What about Aerith? Where did she go? I was just talking to her. Aerith left with Leon and the others, remember? Huh? You worried us just standing there by yourself. Is this what she meant? Yes. You're gonna have like Kyrie come up and be like, you're supposed to join the dark side or something. So we're probably gonna have to fight like Ansem and all that shit again. Nani? I still don't know what these red orbs are. to save there. Let me just save again. Uh. Out of safety reasons. Excuse me, by the way. File screen, yes. Okay. Uh. <laughs> One second. Uh. Okay. Alright. Thank you guys for watching the stream. Uh, we finished Kingdom Hearts 1. We're on Chain of Memories now. Not as bad as everyone was telling me it was. I actually think it's not, it's pretty decent of a game. I just kind of wish it was turn-based instead, but it's not bad. Um, so, that's all for now. I know the stream was shorter than usual. Only four, four hours and ten minutes. Normally I do like six-hour streams, but I started the stream a lot later than I intended to, so it's already pretty late for me. It's like 5 p.m. for me now, so I have to start work on tomorrow's video uh, pretty soon. But I did enjoy uh, the first game very much. This was very enjoyable. Hopefully we can blast the Chain of Memories relatively quickly and then get on 358 and then 2. I'm really curious to see how 2 has changed from 1. Because I believe 358 is just a movie on this disc. Um, but yeah, man. If you guys are interested, on Saturday I'm going to be streaming uh, Danganronpa Ultra Despair Girls. 